Entertainment and action from the start at Kenilworth Road. Luton were behind after two minutes. Jamie Campbell slipped, giving Dave Regis his chance. After 20 minutes, it was 2-0. Des Linton heading Orlickson's corner into his own net. It didn't take long for Luton to get back into the game. Kerry Dixon sized up his options and found the top corner with a delightful curler. A great goal that, so was the equaliser by Kerry Hughes. A Mitchell Thomas cross was put away by Scott Oakes, so if you're keeping count, 3-2 at half-time. In the second half, Luton were playing with so much confidence that further goals were inevitable, Dixon led the way. And Dixon doubled his total for the season when he completed his hat-trick. John Harston came on to get the last one, but this was six of the very best from Luton, three of them from Kerry Dixon. I kept looking at the caption at the top of the league and seeing the leading goal scorers and I wasn't there and no one from Luton was and uh, you look at the goals for and it was a little bit disappointing but um, I mean this should lift the lads but as I've always said you've got to create to score and uh, I'd like to think we can get six or seven chances at home and at least three or four away from home to have a reasonable chance of scoring and that's anyone not just me.